Is IVF often seen as the first solution to infertility? Are we missing something important here? The common perception pegs IVF as the immediate answer to fertility struggles. Yes, it's been a game changer for many, but does it need to be the first step? Imagine if there were other effective, less invasive, and potentially more affordable options to consider before IVF. Let's delve into the less talked about side of IVF. IVF can come with a hefty price tag, with an average cycle costing between $15,000 and $30,000 in the US, according to Forbes. But the cost isn't just financial. Potential dangers of IVF drugs for mothers and babies, along with long-term risks for IVF-conceived children, need to be factored in. And let's not forget the emotional toll. The process can significantly impact a woman's mental health, adding stress to an already challenging journey. Weighing these considerations, should IVF really be the primary choice? What if we told you there are alternatives that can be explored first? Seek to understand any underlying causes and optimize reproductive health naturally before stepping into the world of IVF. A study by Foresight found that couples who used a pre-conceptual healthcare program before IVF had a 47% higher success rate. Not to mention, this route eliminates the potential side effects associated with IVF. Could these natural fertility optimization methods be the less invasive, more affordable first step we need? We've presented some food for thought on IVF versus natural fertility optimization. We've dug into the potential side effects, the financial burden, and the importance of exploring natural means first. We've highlighted that IVF can be a tool, but perhaps not the first one to reach for. We'd love to hear your thoughts or experiences on this topic. Share them in the comments below. After all, dialogue fosters understanding and growth.